yo 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 so as most of you probably know from my last video i have moved back into the family home this is good for a couple of reasons one it means that i'm not paying rent two my mom is such a good cook and three it's nice to just be around really nurturing energy but in saying that it has taken me a while to kind of settle in and get my bearings but now that I have, I wanted to share with you a little room tour. I also wanted to show you a couple of my new favorite things that I have incorporated into my room. So this video is brought to you thanks to Koala and I will be showing you some of my new favorite Koala products. I've been sleeping on a Koala mattress, this one here, for at least two years now, over two years, and have not regretted it a single night. It's the softest thing in the whole world world and so then I recently also got a koala bookshelf, a koala bed base and koala sheets here and then I've also got a koala pull out sofa bed which I'll show you guys as well. So without further ado let's get to it. I guess I'll just dive straight into it then so when you come in here's the door Ta -da. put up a bag holder and a mirror here hello got these beautiful birds that one of my girlfriends got for me when she was in Vietnam in 2007, I believe it was. So years ago, and I've kept them ever since. This is a beautiful piece by one of my girlfriends, Montana. You might know her, Montana Lauer. She's an incredible woman and climate activist, ocean conservationist, and an exceptional mother as well. She's got the cutest little baby in the whole world, little blue. Um, I was going to put up some art, but I decided against that, and I just went for a hat instead, which I actually just take to the beach often, so normally this wall is just pretty plain. And then I've got my bed and a little mat. I used to think that everything needed to be really just white, like only white, and then moving back in home, I've brought in a little bit more color, and I kind of like it. So then I've got my bed. My bed is the newest edition, which I am obsessed with because it's so convenient. I'll show you. Have a look at this. So my new bed base, I'm wide obsessed with too, it's from Koala. So Koala's a really good brand. I thought they only did mattresses, but then when I discovered that they did furniture too, I was like, should probably get me some of that. But the bed base, it's so easy to put together. Oh my goodness. I am, I'm not technical or um, good with like fidgety things and screws. I cannot build anything to save my life, but I put this together, I put my bookshelf together, I put the sofa together, I, I did it all myself. There's no screws involved, which is just the most convenient thing in the whole world. And it's kind of like adult Lego made of chemical free wood. It's perfect. So behind the bed base, there is all this space for your pillows to be stored in, but also these holes. So these are really good for cable management. So if you ever wanna bring a cable through to be able to plug in your phone or your iPad behind your bed, that's perfect for that. And there's plenty of storage space. <laughs> so you can store whatever you need to underneath your bed, including half of your body. <laughs> I guess I may as well share this part with you now while I'm here. So these are the new Koala pillows and the world's softest sheets and pillowcases ever. I will no longer sleep on anything else. This is, it's, it is honestly like sleeping on, on a unicorn. You know how some pillows are like too big or too thick and then other ones are too thin? These are like Goldilocks pillows. Like they're the perfect happy medium in between. I'll just be right back, guys. No, I shouldn't get back in bed. That's super dangerous because then I'll never get out. And I've just got a little wooden table and I just painted over it. It had a really weird kind of black and white top and I painted it to make it all white. So this is where I keep my eye mask, a couple of my nighttime things that I'll use, um, lip balms and eye gels. My sleeping crystal, this has become my sleeping crystal lately. <laughs> oh, I love it so much. I just hug it or I put it on my heart space and I feel like it connects me deeper to my dreams. A lamp, an iPad for music, a couple of books that I'm reading and I've got a little yoga section. So I've got my yoga mat and my yoga balls. These are really good if you ever get back pain and a couple of blocks, bricks, straps, some candles. And then I've got this little shelf. So this is like my incense stuff, my diffuser, a couple of like salt lamps, a speaker, a little crystal, and a couple more books about yoga, some jewelry stuff. I've got my little study desk. So this is where I get shiz done. This is where I do all my editing. Most of the time, sometimes I go into my brother's office. I've got my meditation cushion. And dun dun dun. 
This is another one that I'm proud of. I did it all by myself. So the bookshelf I put together all on my own. Super proud of myself. And setting it up was actually kind of fun as well, getting to, to get a little bit creative and put everything in its right place. So at the top, I've got just a sign that you can change the letters on, some bright sunflowers and a couple of books that I like and that I'm reading, cute little crystal on top, uh, a mala, some more books, a bowl of little crystals, <laughs> um, a scented candle at the back, one of my favorite rose quartz, some starseed oracle cards, some essential oils, some more crystals, some chakra spray, a sound bowl, some little gong chimes, some more books, and I can't wait to read this one. Apparently it's life changing, but it's so big. Look at it. It's insane. This is a little candle holder that has a Buddha on it, so I can put a candle in it and it reflects light out of it into the shape of Buddha. And then, yeah, down the bottom of this cupboard, is a couple more books and these slides. So you can choose to store all your ugly cords behind one part and completely hide them and no one will know. <laughs> Ta-da! And then I've got my astrological moon planting calendar, which I think is so cool. I love it. One of my friends got that for me. And my cupboard wall. So my cupboard wall, I've taken a lot of Polaroids that were on my fridge and decided to put them up here. So when I lay in bed at night and when I wake up in the morning, I can see them. I got my suitcase, a couple of mats, sleeping bag, bags, and some art and craft supplies up the top over here. And then my friends, we are back to square one. <laughs> also just while I'm here, I wanted to share with you about these little knickers that I'm wearing. These are called Moddy Bodies and they are period proof underwear. They're a cute boy short cut and so they actually feel really cute as well. They're very reliable and they are literally a girl's best friend. Muddy bodies. I have muddy body undies in all different shapes and sizes. I'll actually show you if you like. This is my cupboard. I guess I could show you my cupboard too. Why not? Here is my cupboard. But I've got them in yeah, all different styles. So just like a regular undie, super comfy one. And then I've got a regular lace top one. And I find that that one actually still makes you feel rather floaty and girly. Another one of these regular ones. I've got two of these ones so that I can swap them out. And then once you're finished with the Moddy Bodies um, and you wake up the next morning and you need to change them, you literally just rinse them out until the water runs clear. And then you throw them down the laundry, put them in the wash with all your other clothes. And then Bob's your uncle. They hold up to four tampons worth of liquid or blood. And so that means that I can sleep easy. I don't have to worry about waking up and having leaks through into the sheets and needing to change them. It is by far the most perfect solution and a sustainable solution for us women when we're on our moon cycles. These are by far the softest sheets I have ever, ever, ever slept on. Oh, they're made of 100% eucalyptus tensile, so they're super soft, like ridiculously soft. They're anti-static and they regulate your body temperature, so you never have to worry about waking up in the sweats. I decided to get the eucalyptus color, so it's like a really soft, greeny blue, I suppose. It's a beautiful color, and it's soft, it's so soft. I'm so glad Koala does so many things now, because at first, so I slept on this mattress, on this mattress base, for, you probably know these ones, the blue and the white ones, and people do um, the red wine test on them, so you might have seen that. They, you can put a glass of red wine on one side, jump on the other side, and the wine won't even move. So if you're sleeping with a partner, you won't be disturbed. So I've been sleeping on my koala mattress for at least two years, over two years now, and never regretted it once. It is by far the best thing that has ever happened to my sleep life. So I'm so glad that koala decided to expand and do other things because the pillows, the sheets, the cupboard, the bed base, everything, it's a really good brand. It's a reliable brand. It's so easy to put together. If I can do it, literally anyone can do it. And it's the best night's sleep in the whole entire world. All right, you can go now. I'll be here. <laughs> so a girlfriend asked me recently, she's moving house, and she was like, is it worth to get a koala mattress? Because she knows that I sleep on one. And I, I could not 
whole heart like hand on heart hope to die could not recommend it more it has been such a beneficial addition to my personal sleep life and therefore holistic health and approach to happiness and well-being but to yes i highly recommend it to anyone who is thinking about investing in a new mattress one it's a really good night's sleep and two it's a really good brand and company and it's someone who i'm i'm proud to support and that's why i'm here sharing this with you the brand also just has a really cute approach to business and marketing. So in a lot of the products that you get, you'll get a little koala bear. This one I think is for your arm. It has a strap on it that you can attach it to your arm. And then you can just walk around with your little koala on your arm. You never have to worry about losing it. So cute. They also give back for koala sanctuaries as well. So very proud to be able to own a couple of the koala products. Knowing that by doing so, I've been supporting a good cause as well. And then I set up the koala sofa bed. It starts off looking like this, and then it ends up unfolding into this. Ding! I got my little helper here. Hey, Skip. Hi! So it comes in these boxes, and it's easy to put together in just four minutes by myself. Here we go. Challenge accepted. The koala sofa bed comes in this beautiful lunar gray color. It arrives within four hours delivery if you're in Sydney, Melbourne, Brisbane, Perth or Adelaide and everywhere else in Australia is a one to five day free delivery. Free is my favorite number. <laughs> comes in five boxes ranging from 15 kilograms to 25 kilograms and it only takes four minutes to assemble. Yes, you're such a good help Skip, thank you. So even if you are a furniture goober like I am <laughs> and you can never seem to get it right, it's really hard to stuff this up. It's super simple. Easily within five minutes, you will have set yourself up a beautiful couch and pull out sofa bed. I think one of the best parts about all of the Koala products, but especially the Koala sofa bed, is how simple and quick it is to put together. And just like that, I have a new couch to chill on, meditate on, sleep on, snuggle on, yoga on, and everything in between. I guess that's it. That is my room tour. This behind me is the Koala sofa bed, and it's perfect for any time that you have guests over to come and play with you. So, come and stay, come and play. <laughs> So I guess that is my little room update. Hopefully you enjoyed it and maybe even got some ideas for things that you can do in your own room, especially this bed, game changer, love it. And this bookshelf, dope. So don't forget to like and subscribe and feel free to jump in the comments and say hello, let me know what you think. Love you.